What is an MMS file in Civil 3D? If you're working with AutoCAD Civil 3D and have come across the term MMS file, you might be wondering what it is and why it's important. Let's break it down. When you work with large surfaces in Civil 3D, the software creates additional files to manage the data efficiently. An MMS file is one of these companion files, specifically associated with TIN, triangulated irregular network, surfaces. Here's how it works. If your surface has more than 1.5 to 2 million points, Civil 3D generates an MMS file. This file is a memory mapped surface file, which helps the software handle the large amount of data more smoothly. The MMS file has a specific naming convention. It includes the drawing name and the surface object handle, followed by the MMS extension. For example, if your drawing is named Project Drawing and the surface object handle is Surface 1, the MMS file would be named Project Drawing Surface 1 MMS. One important thing to note is that the MMS file must be in the same folder as the drawing file. If you move the drawing file to a different location, you need to move the MMS file to that same location as well. This ensures that the software can find and use the MMS file correctly. Large surfaces can also lead to large MMS files, which can impact the performance of your Civil 3D projects. To manage this, you can use techniques like reducing the surface data resolution or simplifying the surface to decrease the file size. This can help optimize your workflows and improve project efficiency. In summary, MMS files are essential for managing large surface data in Civil 3D, ensuring that your projects run smoothly and efficiently. By understanding how these files work and how to manage them, you can streamline your design and documentation processes.